Hello? How is everybody tonight? You doing good? Can you jump on and say hello and let us know where you're from? We're going to be working on a wisteria wreath tonight. Hi, Rita. I'm glad you made it home safe and sound. We were all worried about you. How's the weather out there? Hot? We're going to be working on a wisteria wreath tonight. I have had these florals for quite some time and I love the way they look on a wreath. Oh, now I think Carla should come to your house because I think you need help organizing at your place. <laughs> No. Oh. Whereabouts in Texas? Is it like northern Texas or? Because way back in the 70s, late 70s, I lived in El Campo, Wharton, Bay, near Bay City, um, Abilene. So I've been all over. And we left because I couldn't stand the heat. <laughs> and we wanted to be closer to family. Is she? Oh, that's cool. That'll be neat. Then are you going to do a live? West Texas. Okay. That's one place I wanted to visit and didn't get a chance to. Who else we got on? It's showing me two. So when you go on live in your new group on Thursday? I think these are hydrangeas. Are these hydrangeas? I just love these. I wish the leaves would slide all the way up on this one, but they don't. That's okay. I tried joining this morning and of course PayPal was having issues. <laughs> so I meant to do it later and got so busy. So I'll get to it. Oh, okay. All right, we'll get that out of the way. I choose I chose these because they had pink accents 
and I think next to this it's really going to look pretty. But my plan is to kind of place the hydrangeas first and then build around it. We're doing a grapevine. And I may have to move some of this stuff around, but I want to kind of get an idea of where I wanted to place everything. Just kind of a dry run. Hi, Cecilia. Oh, thank you, Casey. I appreciate it. We're just kind of doing a dry run here to see where we look at look at how these wisteria hang. I mean, they are just gorgeous. There was a lady on Craigslist that was selling all her florals when I started. So I went and purchased them from her. And these wisteria were just beautiful. And I've been trying like crazy to come up with something to do with them because I just love the way they hang. Who else we got on? I ripped my last contact, so now I gotta wear the glasses and the bifocals are driving me insane. See, look the way those hang down. Aren't they beautiful? Thank you for spreading the love. It's appreciated. Now they may end up being more of a challenge than they are the centerpiece of this week. <laughs> but I wanted to play with it. I've had a long, exhausting day. I spent almost two hours grooming for one of my puppy parents and their little guy when he came in, he just looked like a real marshmallow. He was so fluffed out. And like I said, it's a challenge with these glasses. Hi, Levine, welcome. Levon's here. Whoop, whoop. We're working on a grapevine wreath with some wisteria. And the grapevine's not cooperating. Right now, anyhow. And like I said, this wisteria may end up to be more of a challenge than I thought. But I needed the, the break. Yeah, see, it's almost like you got to have the wisteria on the outside because it's conforming with the wreath. So maybe just at different light levels. We'll play with it. <laughs> I'm glad I can make somebody laugh because I'll tell you what, today's been a backbreaker. Hi, Christine. How are you? And then you have spend all that time working on grooming that dog and then your back just feels like it's going to break and these chairs are not helping any. Did you guys see my my um my video with little little miracle? Hi, Callie. Callie, did you send me your address? 
because I couldn't uh, I couldn't get it to work for me which is the zip code <laughs> of course I was. I'm just so glad you got your name on there now. Now let's see how many people realize that you changed your name. You did it on my live, Levon. Yeah, it's kind of like this wisteria feels. It has to hang on the outside, not the inside. So, but maybe I can put one there. I know I'm kind of doing this backwards, aren't I? Sorry. But I cannot do it on the easel over my shoulder. I'll, I'll keep turning it around from time to time. See, when I lay it down, it goes like that, but we'll get it. Until I figure out how it's going to fall. Isn't she precious? She stopped growling at me. Every time I walk in the room, she would growl or bark at me. She stopped doing that. And then I started, I'll, I'll try and film her tomorrow because I'm, I've been taking the time to put her in with the other puppies, the other litter. And because they're her siblings, half siblings, different mom, um, same dad. And she's starting to get really playful now with them, which I'm, I'm glad. I know, isn't it? I purchased from this lady who was selling all her florals, and I just, I fell in love with the wisteria. And then I finally found, what are these? Hydrangea? No. Um, oh, help me here. But I found these, and they have like a pink accent in the uh, flower, and it matches the pink in the wisteria. Yeah, I know this is wisteria, but I'm trying to remember what these are green and yellow. Are, are these hydrangea? Is that what that is that what that is? They get real bushy, like. Um, Nope. There. I just love the way they they hang down. Maybe I can put my uh, my easel up here. Let's try it. needs more hype. Um, let me see if I put it up on a tote, see if that'll help any. Might end up being a disaster, but you never know. We'll give it a try.
that looks kind of good hanging there. This I think needs to go up a little higher. getting it in the right area is the challenge so it hangs right where it's supposed to. I like how that cascades. Now I also have some leaves that I can place in there. I also have this which I thought was really kind of cool. It kind of picks up what's inside the coloring. And then this, I thought this was kind of, had a different texture to it. It pulled out more of the green. that's the shorter piece with some floral there we go and again this may not even look right but we're going to give it a try one came from Michael's. I wish they would put the names of the darn things on there. Hi, Carol. How are you? We're working on a grapevine wreath with some wisteria. And we think hydrangea. Not sure what the big poof flower is. And this is a real challenge because we have different things hanging at different levels and the grapevine is creating a challenge. Hi, Marty. And again, we're just kind of doing a dry run in case we want to change it up some. But I just, I, like I said, I fell in love with this wisteria when I bought from the lady. That one's kind of long. 
And maybe that's why it's giving me a fit. Try the shorter one in here. Nope. That doesn't look right. All right. Let's go for the longest one here. Go for the shorter one up here. All right, and we'll get some of this in there. So how's everybody doing tonight? Hi, Sherry. How's the little guy? See, these have like a berry on it with some pit berries too, and the berries are kind of um, glittered, like they've got crystal on them. I thought that would be a nice addition. Just like another texture to add in there. And Marty, you're going to be at class on Thursday. another element in there. Sure am. And Carol, I thought Liz wanted to do the sunflower. There's one more uh, space left in the class. If she's interested. This was one of the items that was in my floral baskets over there that I complained about all the time because it was so top heavy. It would dump the floral basket over on the floor. I'd come down and find all the flowers on the floor all the time. I'm not gonna glue it right away. I'm gonna sit and look at it a while and see it's almost like it has to hang like that so this stuff can kind of swoop that way now i have some leaves that i can place around i don't know i even have this can you guys see that i don't know if this will look good in there or not. I thought it was, it may. Let's put a few pieces in, see what we think. Brings another color into the scheme. What do you think? Or does it or does it not look good because of this? I 
I don't know now. Maybe I need like a softer white flower. I know I like I need some greenery in here, so I'm going to place some of that. I have some of the, the hydrangea leaves I can place around. Yes to what, Rita? This gives it more height is what you're saying? Or this gives it more height, the green with the white? Well, get off the foam, Marty. You mean like this? You're saying that gives it more height? It just, it's white, but it looks so close to this. That's what's, that's what's messing with my eye. Let me see what other white flowers I have. Um, I have white daisies. I have white roses. Um, maybe these would be better because then they're not competing with that other just a little white flower because see this to me feels like it's competing with that texture wise these, I, I don't know. Maybe a rose here and there or a daisy here and there. So I kind of like these because it kind of softens it a little. Nope. Let me try a How about that? A few of the roses in there. What's that look like?
I'm not sure what you mean, Yvonne. By wood set. Trying to look and see what I have. Hi, Denise. Welcome. I think we'll work on sticking some greens in here. That's what it needs. <laughs> I know, right? It would make a beautiful wedding um, decoration, wouldn't it? Shame all my boys are married now. We only have one daughter left to go. Which, I think she's comfortable in her own skin, so I think she'll She'll stay just the way she is. Boy, these things are challenging. It's going to be fun to glue. Let me get some greenery right in there. Maybe... I also have this. I'm not sure if that's going to look good or not. I think this needs to go up a little higher over here.
Sorry, guys. Come back. Come back. Come back to me. <laughs> uh, I told ya. I'm computer cha technically challenged. Found these little green flowers and they're looking nice too. Welcome back. I missed you. My darn Mevo decided to bail on me. I got it back. We're good. Don't leave me. Come back. <laughs> Who came back? Who found me? Hi, Jean. It's okay. We lost the feed and now I'm back. So, welcome back. Still unpacking. Oh, geez. We're making a wisteria. This piece is driving me insane. And it better get with the program. This doesn't want to lay right. everybody come back or did they bail on me looks like everybody bailed on me that's
this one won't be a class because of the fact that um, I bought these from a lady that was closing out her business and I can't get any more of these. The Wisteria, so... We'll just be admiring this one. <laughs> It's almost like that has to go up there further, but it's just not cooperating. And this one needs to go up here so it can cascade down here. Oh, did you ever have one of those days? I think this is turning out to be one of them. If I put this in there. We are doing a... Marty's coming on Thursday. We're doing a big sunflower. I got the unique in the creek boards. And we're going to... We already did one class on them because everybody was requesting them. I don't know what it needs. Oh. How's everybody stay going? Everybody gave up trying to come back.
who was it? Mavon thought this would be really pretty for a wedding. And I totally agree. And one of my designers, the teachers, told me, if you're ever going to do a wreath, just pick out what you want to put on it and don't put any more on it because what end up happening is you end up you keep piling and piling and then when you go to sell it you have to charge so much for it that uh, it's not worth all that you put into it so all right I think I think we're good on that I think we're going to just go ahead and make the bow. And I have these three ribbons picked out. Thank you, Beverly. But I want to add a third and I'm, or a fourth. And I'm just not sure. Let's try. I don't know. Can you guys see what I have down there already? I'm looking for my favorite one, and I'm not seeing, there it is. I love this one, but then I got polka dots up here, so this probably isn't a good one to add, because I already have polka dots, and I'm not liking this one, so... I don't know. What do you think of these for? Can you see them? Do you like those? Hi, Bobby. That's Wisteria. Isn't that pretty? Thank you, Beverly. We've got this green vine hanging here. We have a couple roses. Somebody said this would look good for a, a wedding. I, I love wisteria. It just is such a beautiful um, cascading flower. I don't see anything else that I think would go good, but I wanted to kind of keep it muted, so um, wait a minute, maybe this one. No, then maybe I have too many stripes in there. Oh. We've got green in there. Wait a minute. couple that might work too. Thank you, Kitty. I know that's what I'm thinking has to go. So I know we don't have any lavender, but this has some pink on it. Let's see. As any of my students will tell you when they come, I have way too many choices. Um, okay, this is kind of like, maybe, new one 
snow. Um, oh, geez. I know, what do you think of this combination? I do love this one though. Okay, you saw the ones with the polka dots. What do you think, Jonathan? Those four? See, I'm, I'm not like, I think I think we'll go with these four. So I like this too, but that's too muted. Or we do this. Yeah, but which ones? <laughs> Uh, everybody's in love with the wisteria but I'm trying to figure out what to put in there ah wait a minute I think this one, in place of this one, what do you think? Because then that's pulling out the green. And then we got the green and the pink and the white. I think that's the ticket. Oh, man. Too much to choose from. Huh. <laughs> I confuse myself every time. I just keep making it harder and harder on myself. And now I lost one of those darn little pegs again. I don't. No. Yep, that's it. That's what we're going with. Now, I know I had my wire. There it is. You came back. You came back. My Mevo was not plugged in and it decided to power itself down. Yes, they can, Jonathan. They drive me absolutely insane because I thought I had it all picked out. I bought that bicycle ribbon and I so want to use it. I'm, I guess what I have to do is make a sign. I have a sign already in my cricket like um, thing. So I guess I just need to make a sign so I can use the ribbon, right? Aren't you going live tonight? Did I put up enough videos of puppies today for everybody? Yeah, this puts a little bling in it, a little glitter. I like this. 
I think that's the ticket. If I can get it to stay. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad you could join us. Maybe you just need to watch a few lives to get inspired. I find myself sometimes where I just need to step back and get inspired. Do you ever feel that way? You never get enough, right, Bobby? <laughs> She has been playing and playing and playing today. And they've been playing with Miracle. Poor little Miracle. She gets in there and they all clobber her. Yes. And I'm thinking that maybe Saturday, if I can last that long, might be bath day. If anybody wants to come and help bathe their baby. And we have to soon pick out bed color. I ruined my one contact today, so now I have to rely on my glasses totally with the bifocals. And they're driving me absolutely insane. Yep, I hear you. People sometimes just don't understand the amount of work that goes into this. And it's it's a creation. It's it's a it's an art piece. It's you know Sometimes I have several over there that I just have to get inspired. And until I get inspired, they're going to sit there until I have that aha moment and figure out what I want to add to it. It has to talk to me. And so far, it hasn't talked, so it's still over there. How long is it going to be in the shop, Bobby? Because they probably should be done tomorrow. Oh, good. So I finally got Maddie done today. She needed it. And Oreo, she got done on Saturday. Because she went home this morning. All mine have to be done. Well, I got two of the seven done. I think the pink next. I don't know. Let me see. Nope, we'll stick with this one. Okay, great. Sounds like a date. Now I'm going to have to figure out how to post this to YouTube. I'm probably going to have to do um, part one and part two. <laughs> so it's, it's two lives. 
and I can't splice them together. So, what the heck? There we go. Now, since I want two rows of the pink striped, I'm going to move, well, let me dovetail first, and then I'll explain. I'm going to move this off the pin and move it up, so I have room to put the two rows of pink on here that I want. I like this green. I think that's the perfect one. Well, if you know how to take the back end of a video off, I'd love to learn that because <laughs> the last live I did, I left the stink amoeba on and walked upstairs and it was filming for about 20 minutes after. And I tried to take it off. I can't get it off. It won't let me take off the back end. So, it's just filming in the dark. <laughs> I, I told you, I'm so technically challenged. I thought I could do it too, and I was trying to do it like you showed me, and it said it could not take off the back half, the back end of the, of the video. So... Go figure. And I think I need another computer. I think I need one that has a camera on it. Because when I went on Lori's live on Monday, on uh, Saturday night, I looked at it afterwards. They really couldn't see what I was doing because I had to use my cell phone. So I think I need that. Can never get this pulled tight enough. There we go. That's better. <sighs> Levon, did you come back? Denise, Carol, Marty. Sherry, did you come back? I don't think you did. They left me all alone. I'm getting punchy, you all. <laughs> really? Get out of town. Oh my gosh. See, I needed you in my life, Bobby. I did. And so did Lulu. That little sweetie. Oh. Okay, y'all, who's passing out the drinks? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Pull the peg out. There we go. <laughs> Got rid of it fast. <laughs> Can you tell I need sleep? I need a vacation. You know when I'm going to get a vacation? On Thursday. Thursday they're going to give me that funny juice and knock me out. 
And that's when I'm going to get my vacation. <laughs> I have to go to the ear doctor to have a tube put in. So when he gives me that funny juice, I'll get my nap that I need. <laughs> Why is that doing that? Because it's being stupid. You just you just tell me what I need to do, Bobby, and I'll do it. Because <laughs> I have no clue. Say third time's charm. Let's try it again. I have no clue. That thing just shut itself off again. It's telling me something about files, too, that um, I have to dump some files, but that thing doesn't have a card in it. It doesn't have anything in it. So, what the heck? I'm losing it. <laughs> I've had it. Did it interrupt again? Oh, good. God. Is it, am I back on? I don't think so. That's why I thought if I had the Mevo connected to my computer, I wouldn't have to worry about, see, if I don't have the earphones plugged into the phone, then what it does is it gives you this horrible noise. So why I have those in, I can't plug it in to charge it. So I have no clue. I'm ready to scream. It's almost like it's telling me that my phone has a card or that the camera has a card in it and I got to get some stuff off of it. So I thought if I had the camera synced with my computer, it might be better off. I wouldn't even have to use my phone then. Oh my gosh, I am loving the green with this pink. Holy cow. Sorry. It, 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 it ribbon is the only excitement I have left. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I just love this color. Now everybody left me except you guys and, and now they won't get to see it. Oh well. They can watch the replay. But I just love this green. Oh my gosh. Sorry guys. <laughs> and I gotta stand up to do this. I spent over an, almost two hours grooming a little guy today and my back is killing me and I 
want to sit down, but when I sit down, I can't see what I'm doing. I'm getting rough with the bow. It's not doing what I want, so it's time to show it who's boss. Who came back? Show yourself. I'm going to have to finish putting this together and list it because this would make an awesome floral arrangement for a wedding. And it is beautiful. Did you come back, Jean? Bobby, your mom's on. We've only been kicked off twice already, Jean. So this is the third time. <laughs> and I'm ready to commit myself today. How's your day going, Jean? Mine's kind of crappy so far. <laughs> on this live, that is. And your daughter's going to come and rescue me tomorrow. <laughs> My bow is, is pooping out on me. My Mevo is pooping out on me. The puppies are pooping. And we didn't get a picture of you and, um, was it Becky? The other night. We didn't get a picture of your sunflower. I did talk to um, my other puppy mom that has the um, rubber stamps. And she said she will go through them and tell me what she's got. So once I find out, I'll let Becky know. Okay, that's about as real as it's going to get. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's not even laying right. What the heck? This isn't my first bow. This sucker's gone on. <laughs> I'm done. Okay, 
I'm done. <laughs> I know that I saw that. And I think I did. I'm not sure if I did post it. But there we go. Our wisteria wreath with a few roses. And we was oh man what the heck is that one called i want to say hydrangea i think that's what it is and then we got wisteria going on down here and we got this green funky thing that doesn't want to stay where i put it <laughs> it's a disaster but you'll have this Oh, excuse me. Hi, Connie. We're throwing in the towel. This is the third time our my Mevo ditched. Second time, it, third time it ditched on me. Hi, <laughs> Bonnie. Welcome back. <laughs> what do you think of those ribbons? We went with a different, uh, this green really makes this pop, doesn't it? And the pink. Let me see if I can zoom in on it. Does that work? Now I can't get that thing off of there. What do you think? Because I'm not feeling the love from my Mevo right now. <laughs> How's that? Maybe if I put it up here. Does that work? Or is it too close? It's too close. Well, if I wasn't cutting off the top of the screen, I might be able to see it better. There. You know, right? It's so pretty. And I'm glad I took the bicycle out of there and the polka dot out of there. I think that, that just works. We've just had it with my Mevo. <laughs> Look, we're back down to three watching. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's just not my day. But that's okay. You guys came. We had a few good laughs. <laughs> I broke a contact today. I can't get into the eye doctor until next week. So. I have to wear these stinking glasses till next week. But hey. The wreath is beautiful. I don't know how that got back there. Somebody will like it. I'm just not feeling the love for my computer right now. I mean my Mevo. And I gotta go up and feed the babies. So. And Bobby's gonna come help me tomorrow. She's gonna come rescue me. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry for all the technical difficulties. 
I guess you can't always have it the way you want it, right? It's life. Okay. All right, now I'm going to remember to shut the Mevo off so it's not filming in the dark after I leave and go upstairs like it did the last time. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm feeling the love. Not from my Mevo, but from you guys. All right, I will see you tomorrow, Bobby. We're going to have bath puppy bath day, LaVon. So she's going to come help me be the puppies. Maybe we'll take a few pictures of them sopping wet. Okay. All right, you guys. Thanks for popping in and popping out and popping in and popping out and popping back in again. I really appreciate it. <laughs> All right. You have a good evening. Thank you. Good night.